put this side the front. Are you ready to go back to school? Are you going to behave in school? Okay, remember, I have that on camera. Okay. Mm. So. Mm. It's like you gotta eat. Are you ready for the first day of school? First day of school today, so he's watching TV, and I'm standing here by the window, waiting to see if the bus is going to come or not, or when it comes, because he's on a different bus this year. So. It's six something in the morning, I can tell that when I go back to work and have to wake up at four in the morning that I'm gonna have a hard time because I can't even wake up at six in the morning. I fell back to sleep when Adam's alarm clock went off. Are you ready to go back to school? Are you gonna behave in school? Okay, remember, I have that on camera, so I better not get no phone calls from no principal or teacher. Are you going to listen? Are you going to pay attention? Are you going to learn something? That's good. I pretty much don't know how to read. Oh, that's what they teach you. That's why you got to pay attention. Because this year they're starting spelling with you guys. You know what spelling is? You know how you write your name? That's spelling. You're going to have to figure out how to spell words. Like ball. ABCs. No, ABCs is just the ABCs. Cars. Like words. The cars. Yeah, can you spell ball? Sound it out, see if you can spell it. Ball. 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 So what's that letter? B L B A A Ball. B A L L. That's how you spell ball. So you're going to have to learn that in school. That's why you got to pay attention. And guess what? This teacher has homework every day. That's the only way you learn. Are you going to have a good day at school today? I hope it's gym today. Well, Seth, remember, school is not about fun. You can have fun sometimes, but you also need to pay attention. one thing I struggle to get through to him that school is not about playing. It's about learning. So we'll see how this year goes. It's hopefully good. Now that he's in the first grade, it's a little bit more serious than preschool and kindergarten. So we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Tree stop and make sure you get the truck and stop. Well, you can always, oh, run, Seth. You gotta go back over where you normally go. Bus is there, so go. Have a good day at school. We're off to my doctor's appointment. And I am not feeling the best at all. I'm super tired. And I got a belly ache. Tonight that's so well. Pizza! 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 Very goofy. Okay, so I just put Kenna down for a nap. And Adam just left for work. So now, hopefully I can get a little bit of cleaning done. I have so...
so much laundry to fold and I don't want to do any of it. I am going to attempt to get the computer downstairs today. That is my goal, to get this computer downstairs so that um, I can get, I'm um, where this computer is right now, is like a little nook area kind of behind the couch. I'm going to move the couch too, but I'm going to put the swing back here and the pack and play back here because that's how we had it when McKenna was born. So I'm going to upload yesterday's vlog and do all that stuff. And I hope that Seth's first day of school is going good because, I don't know, my sister told me that when she went in for orient, took her son in for orientation that nobody was sitting by him. So, I just, I don't want him to hate school like I did, because I hated school. I got, okay, elementary school and middle school, I got straight A's. I flew by in elementary and middle school, but I was still picked on and all that stuff. Um, so it really sucks. I just don't want him to hate school. I want him to love school as much as possible and get straight A's. <laughs> I'm not expecting straight A's out of him. I just really want him to enjoy school and be able to learn things without other kids being mean. Um, he can be a little bit rambunctious sometimes. That's why I worry about it. But I just hope he's got like two and a half hours left until he comes home from school. So I'm excited to get things done while she's sleeping and see how his first day went. I am really, really excited for it. So. Okay, so this is what I'm talking about. This is my laundry basket of clean clothes. And it's also completely full in there. And I have to get it full <laughs> So, and then I have more laundry to fold, and it sounds like she's just playing in there. She's not even taking a nap. So, I might have to go in there and lay her back down again, but whatever. It gives her a little bit of chill out time while I get some stuff done, too. <clears throat> Alright, so it is 3.10 right now. So, I am waiting for Seth to get off the school bus. I feel a little bit accomplished. I got all the laundry folded and I got the socks matched and the floor swept and the counters cleaned and I dusted my entertainment center. So that's nice. And now I'm just excited to see him get off the bus and um, see how his first day went and if he has homework right away because the teacher did say that they'd have homework every single day so I don't know how true that is and hopefully he has made some friends in school I hope again because I don't want him to I hate school I know it's only the first day but I know how hard it can be sometimes And as much as he can tick me off and make me mad at home, of course, you know, I feel for my little man if something's going on. You know, I'm his mom. It's my instinct. I wish the bus would get here. It's already 3, 3.11. And we live only a couple blocks away from school, but I still let him ride the bus home. Alright, his bus is here. Let's see if he gets off. Last year, a couple times, he didn't get off the bus. So, hopefully he is getting off. Hmm. I don't see him.
Well, it turns out he got on the wrong bus at school. So now I have to wake McKenna up and go get his butt at school. So I hope she's up. So Seth's teacher got him on the wrong bus, which means that I had to um, wake McKenna up out of her toy box. If you guys can kind of see that little clip, her bedroom was light was off, so if you can see that clip, she fell asleep in her toy box. So I had to wake her up and go get Seth from school because the bus driver just dropped her back, dropped him back off at school. Otherwise, Seth, come here. I'm making supper right now. What? Do you want to tell them how your first day at school was? Very yeah, good. I don't know if they heard you. Good. Good? But they didn't give you anything to eat. They only give you milk. You're a big boy now. They don't have snack days. Seth, off of there. They don't have snack days. You just eat your lunch, and that's why you eat breakfast at home in the morning. Yeah. Alright, go we'll clean your room. Mm -hmm. We did his homework right away this um not this morning, obviously. Um, did I use that? We did his homework right away when he got home from school. So that is all done, which is nice. I'm thinking that's the way we're gonna do it too. Right away when he gets home from school. Hi baby, are you playing outside? Okay, and I am making spaghetti. Attempting to make spaghetti. I hate this meat. And I don't know where my good spatula thing is. Huh, well that's weird. Oh, well. and I got dishes to do. And guess what? I got the computer downstairs. I feel a little bit accomplished today because I've gotten a lot done. So I'm pretty much not in a very good mood because in the middle of cooking supper, my stove decided to stop working. Um, <clears throat> normally what happens if I have two burners on high and then I go to turn my oven on because it's all connected in one, it's too much for the breaker. probably can't see me very well but I wanted to show you the area in my living room where I used to have my computer hopefully maybe you guys can see maybe maybe not not I guess I'll have to show you that tomorrow but I'll bring you downstairs in my room sorry it's gonna be dark for a few minutes 
and my room is a complete disaster because I had to move everything. That's going to go upstairs. And then I brought the computer down here. This is my side of the room. Side of the bed, whatever you want to call it. But um, I put the computer here and the filing cabinet here facing this way with the printer on top. And it's really nice. Now i got to turn it back on since I was messing with the stupid breakers. It's so annoying. I got the stove and oven back on, but not in time for me to make supper, but I had to fry up the rest of the hamburger. So. Start normally. Okay. So, yeah. I bought stuff so that um, I could pack my diaper bag soon. And I should have the nursery tour up soon. I have it completed, but anyways, I have the kids in bed now, so I have a whole ton of stuff that I have to do because I couldn't do it because I had to run and get something to eat, but I guess this is it for tonight's vlog, and I'll see you guys again tomorrow. Bye!